Welcome back, Pokemon community, to another exciting episode here at the PokeBro channel. Today we have ourselves a little bit more of a mixed opening, just as usual. We do have a Dragapult Prime that's got two celebrations in it and Vivid Voltage, plus the Prime card. I believe we got this one around $17 or so, price on screen. And same with the Lucario V-Star box. These are, uh, this is the premium box. Usually you see this in stores for around 40 sometimes if you go to a card shop, maybe $50. Uh, price on screen for that, we paid $27, I believe, and some change. Free shipping on all of this as well. And just to spice things up a little bit, we've got four of these single blisters. We've got three Astral Radiance and one Brilliant Star. So let's see what we can get into today. It's been I know it's been a while since... I've uploaded a video. I think we're going to kick things off first with these four single blisters here. We've got the three Astral Radiance, and then we've got Brilliant Stars. I think we'll uh, tear into these first. See if we can get a one-pack magic out of this single blister. Searching for that alternate art today. Hopefully, out of the uh, Brilliant Stars, we get a Lucario box for that alternate art Charizard. Or the Rainbow Charizard. All right. There's the code card for you. Let's go one, two, three to the front. A couple of good tap. Oh, I believe it's four. I messed up. So we've got Executor, Blunder Policy, Throw, Shroomish, Piplup. Turtwig, Sneasel, Snarmy, uh, Starby, a nice looking non hollow muck, and there's the fighting energy. All right, let's see if we can get something out of Astral Radiance. Hoot hoot. There's the code card for you. Four to the front, not three. Let's not make that mistake again. There's fighting. Ooh, double fighting energy. Canceling Cologne. Sheldon. Heavy Ball. I've been playing on the TCG online and I've seen, I've come across a couple decks that use this, that utilize this. Electrode and non hollow rare. I'm not a huge fan of what they did to Palkia and Dialga. I, you just took his arms off. There's the code card for you upside down this time. Oh, almost got right into it. We go one, two, three, and four to the front. And fire energy. We've got this bog. Okay. And I've played against this bog as well. Put two damage on your uh, damage counters on your Pokemon whenever you play a basic Pokemon. Some of the new stuff floating around. We've got Cyndaquil. And Sneasler Holographic. All right. Last pack of the single blisters before we get into... I think we'll do the celebrations first. I've been itching open some at least one pack of celebrations. It's been a long time. We've got Hoot Hoot. There's the code card. One, two, three, and four to the front. Double tap for good luck. There's Water Energy. Yon Mega. Hoot Hoot. Cricketot. Stantler. Quillfish. Scyther. Cyndaquil. And Non-Holographic Rare. Alright. And next up we're going to get into this Celebrations Dragapult Prime Box. You know, I really don't know if, if the little binder in back is for the big card or if it's the four sleeved ones for the smaller ones. But we will find out. And with a little bit of YouTube magic, this box will be open. All right, and this just is a little pamphlet inside, inserted into the back. And we have our little binder. And let's take a look and see if it's for big card. Nope, see? I'll have to go get a, a different little binder for the promo card then. But this is good. We, uh, I don't mind having this. Although I would have liked having the bigger one. And you, and you know, for the price, we have our Dragapult Jumbo Card Prime. This one looks really nicely cut. Usually these 
giant promo cards are terribly, terribly cut. This one has really nice, well-done corners. I would say pretty well-centered to a little bit thin and thick on the bottom. And then this side the same. But we have, I think we have a double swirl somewhere here. Uh, so we have a dot with like a swirl in it. It's kind of covering it up. And then I think, was there one more? There's another one. Oh, there we go. Next to the next to the energy symbol, there's one at the top. So we got double swirl action on this card. And of course, we have it would be perfect, but I think we have a slight print line here. And then one that goes across here at the bottom. I don't know if the camera picks it up. But really nice prime card. All right, and of course, we've got our giant jumbo coin there. We do like the jumbo coins. There's the smaller version, the regular version card of the same one we just looked at. This one, I don't know. It's not well centered. It's decent but not great. The corners are really good. And then I flip it over and I see a little bit of whitening and it's not rubbing off and a little bit of whitening and it's not rubbing off right there on that corner and just a little hair on that corner. But other than that, that's great. No print lines. Just a little dent when it was inside the protector. And wouldn't it be wouldn't it be crazy if we got something else? Another giant rainbow Pikachu. I don't think it'll happen, but that is the right color code card. There's the code card. One, two, three, four to the front. Wouldn't it be something to pull another rainbow Pikachu? Substrika, Dustclops, uh, Dust Pick-a-Peck, Mudberry, Joltik, Weedle. We've got the Crocodile and Colossal V. All right, now let's tear into these. Celebrations pack. I'm really nervous. It's been a minute since I've opened these. And I, could, I don't think you can open them like this, really, can you? Yeah, you can. Uh, let's guess Palkia on this one. Ooh, I don't think it's Palkia, though, but it did open nicely. We've got Xerneas. Let's just get right into them. With Mega Print Lines, Dialga. Okay, we've got uh, Rocket Admin. That's a hitter. And Solgaleo, there's the code card. And straight into the next one. Yeah, these opened up nicely. At least that one did. No, it's not working for me. Not on that one. I really want the Charizard. Come on. I don't think I've pulled the Venusaur yet. Or maybe I have. No, yes, I have. I don't... Um, I don't... I think I've pulled the Blastoise. And we forgot to guess. Xerneas. Kyogre. Hey, hey Surfing Pikachu VMAX. You know, we've pulled that many times... But that's okay. Every pack of celebrations is a good is a good pack. And next up, we've got the Lucario Premium Collection box. This is the V Star box with a pin in it. Let's get this open. And of course, we've got the Jumbo card. This one does look good. A little off centered as usual. Corners are nicely cut. They're getting better with these Jumbo cards, I believe. At least they're getting the corners better. Not so well as the centering. This is a textured one? No? No, it just looks textured. Of course, we've got the pin. If it'll focus on it. I'm a sucker for the pins. And the promo looking really good, too. Good corners. No real damage that I can see from being inside its case. It's just a little off-centered. This one's the one that's better. Well-centered. Corners are better. Nothing wrong with this one. And the nice acrylic. Not paper, not cardboard coin, or a V-Star marker, I'm sorry. Nice 
hard. It feels like acrylic or plastic. And then here we have all our packs inside there. One, two, three, four, five, six. You know, for the price we got, we got to be paid $27 and some change. But we could round it up to $28. Still better than what you would pay at the retailers at big boxes like Target and Walmart. And even better than what you would pay at a card shop. So let's, uh, let's get into this with... Chilling Rain first. A lot of good cards we can pull out of Chilling Rain. Still haven't pulled that Zapdos alt art where he's running up the hill. That would be nice. We've got Galarin Farfetch'd. There's our code card. Two, three, and four to the front. Fire Energy. We've got a backpack, Porygon, Sobble, Heracross, Inke, Sobble again reverse, and Zeb Stryka. Just gonna get into these the way they the order that I pulled them out. Alright, we've got Magmar showing. There's the code card. Two, three, four to the front. Couple double taps for good luck. We've got Grass Energy, Magma Basin, Hit my top, Luxio. And the Magmar that looks like it should belong on a Christmas sweater, honestly, though. Really great artwork. Maybe someone out there has already made it into a Christmas sweater. We've got Staryu, Car Blast, and Lipard Non Holographic Rare. Fusion Strike, looking for that alternate art Gengar. I believe it's an alternate art, or. With the VMAX, I'm not sure. There's the code card for you. We've got Grass Energy, Grappolot, Digsbury, Belltoy. We've got Corsola, Quillfish, Vulpix, Rotom. Grim Snarl Holographic Single Strike. We've got three packs left. I don't think I've pulled too many things from Fusion Strike. It's been a good minute. All right, so with this artwork, this is the Schmirgo line. They share the same art. It tells a little story. I like those. Those are nice. I wonder if this comes in reverse. So let's get that code card. There it is for you. Four to the front. Double tap for good luck. You know, let's guess water. Oh, it's lightning. Shmir, uh, Simisage. Battle VIP Pass. Wulu. Not making it happen in this pack. Zera Aura. Non hollow rare. Brilliant stars up next. Come on, Rainbow Charizard. All to art. You know I need to add you to my collection. We are due for something. These packs have been kind of dry. We don't think we've pulled too much. A couple of hollows. There's the code card. Four to the front. Double tap. We'll gas. Uh, we were going to guess Grass, but it's Dark Energy. Ooh, I think I saw something. We've got Weevil, Hunting Gloves, Dust Skull, Farfetch'd, Execute, Grimer, Sneasel, Double Pack, Mimikyu, V. That's the Trainer Gallery everyone's been trying to pull. That is a nice card. Oh, wow. And then a double banger here. We've got Zarud V, Double Pack, it does, that's the card. That's one of the cards we we definitely wanted to pull. Those, that's a we we're definite fans. My mom especially definite fan of the Mimikyu. We've got Dupider. There's the code card. All right, Lightning Energy, Sharpedo, Dunsparce. Dupider, Meowth, Onyx, Toodle, Shroomish, Basculine, Bas Basculine, yeah, Claydol, non -hall. All right, and you know what? I think we were we were having such a good time. I think we're gonna open up one more box of something. I have something 
over in the shelves, so I think we should open up. I it just I'm really feeling lucky, like we're gonna get something. I'll be right back. All right, and as a little bonus for sticking around, we're gonna open up this Shiny Fades Pikachu V box. I got a stack of these, and I really want a Charizard out of here. So let's tear this open. All right, and as usual, we have our jumbo card. This one I think is the best yet. Good centering, good corners. This is the 10. No whitening on anything. That's just, that's just hopefully just dust. No, it's not. That is something on there. Darn it. This is 10 worthy. This is perfect. And then we've got uh, the smaller regular card. This one does look good too. Just like the big one. Just a little, not as well on the back. And we're a little mangled on that side. But that jumbo card, though, looking real good. And we've got our four packs here, shiny fates. Let's uh, let's save the Charizard pack artwork for last. Let's get into the Dragapult. There's the code card for you. Four to the front. Rusted Shield, Camarant, Ball Guy, Eevee, Morpeko, Nicket. Hey, we've got our shelves of Shiny and a non hollow Selby. I remember this from the anime. He's one of the Pokemon that just gets made because the archaeologists throw just throw stuff together. They didn't really know what they were doing. I think this is one of the harder ones to pull, too, if I'm not mistaken. Price on screen for that one. All right, we've got Pokemon's best taxi, Corviknight. Gotta hurry because the battery is not lasting. There's the code card. Water Energy, Team Yeltel, Luxio, Floatzel. We've got Roulette, Chew, uh, Choodle, Morpeko, Coughing, Glossifer, Eevee, and Boss's Orders, non hollow rare. Last. Second to last pack, we've got Shink Showin. There's the code card. Four to the front. We've got Lightning Energy. The last pack was Lightning Energy too. Luxio, Gym Trainer, Team Yeltel. We've got Shinx again, Rolla, Eevee, Morpeko again. I mean Eevee again. And no, I mean Morpeko again. And Indeedy Hollow. Wow, just a lot of repeats on that one. And last pack. Hopefully we do get some last pack magic. It is a real thing. We'll give them some belly rub. Hopefully that's a real thing. And thank you for sticking around till the end. We got ourselves a little bonus opening. And I really appreciate staying around. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share the video with everyone you know so we can get the word out about Pokebro channel. Let's rip this open. Even if we don't get anything, we had a great opening today. See, we got more Peko. There's the code card. Two, three, and four to the front. That card's a little mangled. Hard through the cutter. Double tap for good luck. Let's guess fighting energy. Oh, we got it. Fighting energy on that one. Okay, fighting energy. Rusted shield, Camerant, ball guy, more Peko, coughing, Glossifer. Cacna, Choodle, and Shiny Copperjaw to end it off. Not bad. That's not bad. We got a Shiny to end it off. That's that's good. And Volcanion, non-hollow rare. We had ourselves a good opening today. 